because I came at a bad time. No, no. I think you couldn't have timed it better. <sighs> Cleaning up other people's mess isn't in my job description. You know, Kafka? The receptacle's ready. Your decision. Mm. <laughs> Elio said this decision will bring about lots of changes. There we go. How much does she remember? Hm. I'll remember you. Time to get up. Why does it always have to get this exciting? Anyway, at least you're back. Take the express and leave. I'll stay. But... Let's go. Wait, march! Huh? Huh? The Doomsday Beast. It's really here. Get down here! Uh, careful, everyone! Talk somewhere else. The way <laughs> to celebrate. Let's go. I'll be waiting. <sighs> Time to get on. Till we make it. Oh, <laughs> we will see. I'm over here. Take the journey. The universe. The Astral Express. Eons. <sighs> Did I get dragged into a science fiction movie or something? This Stellaron thing. In my. Are you yeah. at the stars? <laughs> done stuff like that before but it wasn't stars for me though it was lights hello 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 all passengers please return to your seats the train is about to make the jump hold on everyone 
I won't fall over. I won't fall over. Five, four, three, two, one. Dare underestimate me. Lady Bronya. I'll handle these evil doers myself. to say, Sampo never lets friends who've helped him come to harm. <laughs> I say what I mean, and I mean what I say. All right, princess, let's dispense with the pleasantries. You dare attack someone on our turf? Well, how about a few rounds with me?
future, it will be good. Everything! Mother, stop! What do you mean? Are you saying rebuilding the Underworld isn't one of your priorities? Of course not. I I'm just saying we have limited assets and we need new parameters. Assets? Parameters? You sure love your fancy words. Ugh, forget it. Leave it to me. I'll go down myself. <gasps> Come on, Sila. I won't leave you to- Look! Branya! There'll be plenty of difficulties waiting for them, right? Yes. Their future is filled with even more uncertainty than ours. But we will prevail here, even if it means arguments like this go on forever. <laughs> they won't go on forever if I win them. We'll no longer live in... Shadow! <sighs> From the moment she knew she was pregnant, <sighs> the day of Pale's birth. <sighs> Never missing a day. Hypothesis. Thought always precedes mm. word. Hey, uh? And yet, I can't find the words for this moment. It's good to see you, Asta. Yes, General. Watch this person carefully. <gasps> Do you remember me? I remember. Of five people, three must pay a price. <laughs> you are not one of them, Jin Yuan. <laughs> of five people, three must pay a price. You are one of them. Long time no see, Astral Express crew. It's Kafka. I came at a good time. You're all here. Every single one. No need for the mysterious introduction, Stellaron Hunter. <laughs> Himiko, correct? Apologies for interrupting your little get-together, but I'm sure once you've heard my request, you'll forgive me. I'd like you to make a... destination alteration. The train is about to make the jump! Five... Four... Three...
rudimentary. Your every move has been foreseen by the Omnisia. Fushuen, Divination Commission. I'll be taking the criminal from here. What's oh, going on with him? What is that? Everybody stay back! Give him this medicine and uh, make him lie down! I mean, make them lie down! Right. Not what you were expecting. Hmm. <laughs> Let's go, Blady. Two more places to visit. <laughs> Observe for a little longer. <laughs> you received the gift of abundance. for you, boy. Behind you is none other than the traitor of the Sienjo. A criminal forever banished. The High Elder of the Vidyadara. Imbibitor Lune. Stellaron hunters were the only ones to infiltrate the Sienjo. In that case, I'll bring both of you to justice! Slashing hunt to fall, one relating the 
Transformation of the Sienjo general into the Void Ranger would cast the law crew back into chaos. Destruction works in fascinating ways. What are you? was a body stolen on a whim. And you, how much longer can you last? The destruction of the Sienjo is nigh. <laughs> Be gone, power of destruction. Tell the Legion that the vengeance of the hunt will fall upon them. <laughs> Enter here are either jailers or prisoners. Which are you? <laughs> Neither. I'm merely a lost traveler. <gasps> what a spectacle. The Stellarot, the Ambrosial Arbor, the Disciples of Sanctus Medicus, the Lord Ravager. A series of threats that almost succeeded in diverting attention away from the crucial question. They who brought the Stellaron onto the Sienjo. What was their motive? <laughs> Will you surrender, or do you require encouragement? Abomination of Yaosher. General, my power does indeed stem from the Abundance. But I'm the same as you. We are both enemies of Yaosher. <laughs> That's right, Jing Wen. <laughs> Stay out of our way. The revival of the Arbor is an omen. It's time for the Sienjo to choose its next path. The Rainbow Arbiter, the Plague's author, the Ruin author. This is a chess game between eons. If you don't stand with the winners, you stand to lose. And this time, we will put the Abundance in their grave. We were here once, seven hundred years. 
years ago. <laughs> Laughing, sparring, and thinking about the future. <laughs> Their faces still linger before my eyes. Like a bygone dream. Shun the tree's growth, the residual plague, water of the ancient sea. Upon the High Elder's command, subdue the eternal roots. Strange. This is different from the breaking of the seal. Why is there no reaction? What's wrong? Not going to plan, huh? Shun the tree's growth, the residual plague. Shun the tree's growth? The residual plague. <sighs> Water of the ancient sea. Upon the high elders' command, command. Subdue, subdue the eternal roots. roots. What's up, guys? Little Gray here. We've come to the scariest, most haunted place in the Lofu, Fixtral Garden. Don't forget to like, follow, and share. Or else I'm gonna check it out. They say there's been paranormal activity You're such a here. dirty cat. You said you'd protect me. How do I stab something in the middle of the body? I think I just saw something go down.
checkmate. Seven hundred years. <laughs> it's never too late to pick up the tab. <laughs> These guys don't look like nice By order of the Supreme Guardian, proceed no further, Miss Topaz. <sighs> Bellabog might be in arrears. But I'm out of pocket. See you later, Captain. How could you do Enough! All of you! I know what to do. Something to say to the Supreme Guardian. The best kept secret to getting something over the line? Always be ready to turn the table. Go, Numbie. <laughs> Projects under my wing have no room for error. Another anomaly in this shining universe. A blooming splash of colors. You are truly beautiful. Uh, hmm? uh, uh, uh. A lady? Uh. <laughs> I offer a sincere compliment. You're akin to a flower in winter. Oh? Uh. Another beautiful uh. soul. Uh. This is a hallucination caused by the giant sting. The commotion must have led to a great shedding of wing particles. Huh? Oh, then maybe the insect wasn't that big? Maybe it was all an illusion? I'm afraid not, March. I have a feeling you're on the right track. I'm gonna check the data when I get back. 
Genius move. And how will you counter it? <sighs> Only an idiot would ask such a question. Just move this here. Hmm. Uh. Uh. <sighs> <sighs> you look distressed. Something the matter? Uh. Hmm. If that's the case. You better get thinking. was unable to sustain its own existence and vanished as if it had never been born. Hmm. The threat is over. Time to get going. Madam Herta fans, this is an urgent broadcast. The great Madam Herta, member 83 of the Genius Society, has been targeted in an attack at the space station. Her current whereabouts are unknown, with no group having stepped forward to claim responsibility. Many heritors are upset at the ineptitude of upper management, having issued strong protest and condemnation. Mr. Squirrelum, this was a premeditated attack. Conclusion. Their target was the space station. But their strategies are still unknown to us. I... That's right. Which is precisely why we need her. The last to lay eyes on her as puppet before the attack was her. Hmm. Um, and you are? 
This is Dr. Ratio of the Intelligentsia Guild, a delegate from the IPC. <sighs> She's only just woken up. Dazed. She may need a few pointers. Parator News Flash. This is an urgent broadcast. I repeat, this is an urgent broadcast. News has finally emerged regarding the attack on Madame Herta. The Annihilation Gang has claimed responsibility for the incident and warned of further activity. The Guild has expressed utmost condemnation. <laughs> the gods of the starry skies have abandoned the world. They give no thought to the masses. Only the wounded savior can bathe the world in the firelight of destruction. Yet always there are cowards trying in vain to reject their favor and escape the wounds. Flee then. Flee as far as you can. No matter the distance, annihilation will find you. Oh. Could it be? Huh? What is it? Look. <laughs> I've been waiting. Hmm. A farce full of trivial concerns. Ultimately, they're just mediocre minds. <laughs> <laughs> 